ओ हीरो कहा जा रहा है मूवी देखने जा रहा हूँ दिव्या को भी बुला लिया मैंने तो बेसिकली तू अपनी करंट गर्लफ्रेंड और एक्स के साथ मूवी देखने जा रहा है हाँ तो तुझे पता भी है ना तू क्या कर रहा है अरे भाई तू तो हर जगह रॉन्ग कॉम्बिनेशन ढूंढ लेता है खाने में भी यहाँ भी कोई चक्कर नहीं है यार सब चिल्ल है जा रहा हूँ मैं अबे क्या हो गया तुझे इतनी फटी हुई हालत में क्यों लौटा अरे भाई आज पता चला रॉन्ग कॉम्बिनेशन क्या होता है इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विद यू सेवन रॉन्ग फूड कॉम्बिनेशन दैट यू आर ईटिंग डेली एंड हाउ यू कैन इजीली अवॉइड देम सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू फिट ट्यूबर स्टार्टिंग विद नंबर सेवन ऑन द लिस्ट इज कर्ड एंड घी एडिंग अ टी स्पून ऑफ घी ओवर द मील कीप्स ब्लड शुगर इन चेक इम्प्रूव हार्ट हेल्थ एंड हेल्प कट दैट एक्स्ट्रा फैट एज वेल बट इफ यू आर हैविंग दिस मील विद कर्ड देन बेटर वॉच आउट Ayurveda states that both ghee and curd are super foods in themselves but their combination is heavy that sits like a pile of bricks on the digestive system having curd and ghee together is a sure shot recipe to slow down your metabolism making you feel lazy and lethargic if you are having a problem losing weight see if you are consuming these two foods together therefore the next time when you sit to eat either top your meal with this sighi or take curd since curd should not be consumed post sunset keep it for breakfast or lunch and add ghee for dinner at number 6 is tomato and cucumber salad before a meal is a choice of health conscious people and no matter where you go tomato and cucumber are two common ingredients of any salad however if you often consume tomato and cucumber together then ayurveda advises that you better stop doing so the properties of both tomato and cucumber oppose each other which is why consuming them together confuses the digestive system this is one reason why sometimes eating as healthy as a salad one faces gas and bloating eating them together is like putting water and petrol on fire at the same time so the next time you make that plate of salad choose one of the two placed at number 5 is fish and milk does having milk and fish cause white patches or is it a myth passed on from generations well considering the lack of modern studies this might be debatable but from an ayurvedic perspective fish and milk are highly incompatible and a definite no milk and fish are both concentrated sources of protein but since their composition is poles apart they require different kinds of enzymes to digest this creates an overload on the digestive system making the blood acidic now this acidic blood might instigate skin allergies in people with sensitive skin so ayurvedic practitioners strictly condemn the combination of milk and fish at number 4 is water after peanuts munch on some peanuts and it instantly triggers thirst yet our elders would advise us to never drink water after having peanuts is it a misbelief or is there a reason behind it not one but two peanuts are rich in oils and as per ayurveda oil and water don't go well try adding water to any oil it hardly combines consuming water after having nuts or foods with too much oil in them may lead to deposition of fat in the food pipe resulting in respiratory irritation and coughing secondly peanuts require a lot of heat to digest but when water is gulped down it hinders the digestion process so the next time you enjoy peanuts remind yourself to keep a gap of at least 20 minutes next is milk and salt do you often suffer from skin problems check out this incompatible food combination in your diet bhujiya with a glass of milk having milk just after a salty meal making the dough with milk 
using milk as a base for various savory curries this list is long according to ayurveda this antagonistic food combination produces toxins that block the subtle channels of the body it makes the blood impure which is why scriptures consider this combination to be among the main culprits behind skin problems salt although can be combined with milk products like curd butter buttermilk cheese and paneer but not with milk cream or malai always keep a gap of at least 30 minutes at number 2 is rice and vinegar is chinese fried rice your go to meal or do you like eating sirke wala pyaaz with rice or some vinegar based pickle with rice well ayurveda has a bad news for you rice and vinegar is a virudh ahar that is incompatible food combination according to ayurvedic scriptures both rice and vinegar have antagonistic properties towards each other when combined they tend and to increase the toxic overload on the liver no wonder many face digestion issues after eating a chinese meal so it is smart to avoid vinegar with rice lemon juice is widely accepted as vinegar's best substitute replace it and let your body take a sigh of relief Finally at number 1 is jaggery and milk. Are you drinking good wali chai to avoid the harmful effects of refined sugar? <laughs> well there is more to it. No doubt jaggery is considered a treasure trove of medicinal properties in Ayurveda. But when mixed with milk its qualities change. In fact you can note this when jaggery is added to hot milk it tends to curdle the milk this combination weakens digestion why invite stomach problems like indigestion gas and acidity when there are much better substitutes available next time you wish to sweeten milk use jaggery powder thread mishri powder or desi khand but avoid jaggery this not only solves the problem but also strengthens the bodily tissues and calms the mind no wonder our grandma used to give us milk with desi shakkar so these were those seven wrong food combinations which according to ayurveda are best avoided now you might come across someone who would say that i eat many of these wrong food combinations regularly but still i have no health problems does ayurveda have an answer to this Yes it says that one who is young or has high digestive fire might not experience the harmful effects of these combinations although if carried on it can negatively show up at later stages well at times we might not be able to avoid such combinations to cope up ayurveda suggests that a daily workout is a simple way to mitigate the side effects of consuming wrong food combinations bitter foods are naturally detoxifying include them often did this video add some value would you want me to cover more of such wrong food combinations if yes then give this video a thumbs up if you are looking for a protein rich natural peanut butter in the indian market check out wow's creamy sattu peanut butter but why this well turn the pack and you will find that it is made using roasted peanuts jaggery sattu and a pinch of himalayan pink salt nothing else no hydrogenated oils refined sugar artificial flavoring or preservatives for nutrition rich snacking this natural peanut butter has 28 grams of protein per 100 grams a great source of healthy fats and calcium you can use it in sandwiches smoothies and desserts to buy wow's creamy sattu peanut butter click on the link down in the description box do not forget to apply the special discount coupon to get 20% off on your order I highly recommend that you check out this video where I talk about 11 extremely beneficial food combinations as suggested in Ayurvedic scriptures. My name is Vivek. I thank you so much for watching.